Hello everybody, Predator 3813, 2, 1, go! And I am here to talk to you about my, no, I'm here to talk to you about my channel. Now, my channel has been quite inactive for quite a while, and I do apologize. And I will get to why it has been inactive, and the things that might be coming up. So, number one, most of you are... Well, like, yeah, most of you have been bugging me, and you pretty much know who you are, uh, have been bugging me about, uh, where is the Bloodless montage? And the answer to that is, it's on my hard drive, it's done, it's all good for, like, I finished it probably a week after the trailer came out. But the unfortunate reason is, I did it in v Vegas after, a f not Vegas After Effects, um, whatchamacallit, Sony Vegas Pro. And, uh, in Sony Vegas Pro, you can render that. You can render videos in so many different types. Like you, could, you have a AVI, MPEG, and whatnot, right? And I somehow recorded it in a file type TMP. It's it was HD, but the unfortunate part about TMP is that YouTube does not process it. That is the stupidest part, right? So I have the trailer all uh, not the trailer. I have the montage itself all done. But, and I tried uploading it a couple times, it's just YouTube does not process the TMP file. So I will try and convert it somehow, I'm still finding and working with programs that cannot convert it. But he, it, one thing about the gameplay is, I go on an 11 kill streak, and then I'm like, oh, I can get the Moab. But then you'll see how I die, it's pretty unfortunate. And then I'll talk about something else then. But that's, that's the thing, I, I'm still trying to convert it with different programs, some programs convert it. It's because like I still want to keep the small file size, right? Like some there was a couple converted uh, uh, programs where it would make it bigger, but it would keep HD, and some wouldn't be HD, but it would make it smaller. So I don't know. I'm still working with it, but we'll see. Only the future can tell what will happen. But I will try and get it out as soon as possible. Now, right here, you're about to see something really, really sad. He, he obviously panic knifed me, right? Because everyone on the enemy team, because like I'm recording this out in the vault, whatever, right? So the whole enemy team had uh, three bars, right? Now, when you have a lower bar, the when someone pops up, they pop up, like, if I have a four bar, because for Modern Warfare 3, and it only goes up to four, and right here, I don't know what the fuck I was doing. Modern Warfare 3, the bar length only go up 1, 2, 3, 4, right? Back in the other CODs, they would go up to 5, but now it's just 4, right? But people still call it 5. So, if in this game, me and my other party member, we were at 4, right? And the other enemy team was at 3. Now, when you are at 3, 2, or even 1, when I turn the corner, when, like, me and another enemy player turn the corner at the exact same time, because I have the four bar, I'm going to see him faster because the like the video signal travel travels faster, right? Like if uh if I have a high speed internet, right? And then you have like I don't know, some really bad internet that goes really slow and lags and you have to buffer most of the time and we when we start a video at the exact same time, I'm probably going to finish faster, going to see the end faster gonna know everything faster right yours might buffer about halfway might lag and whatnot I'm pretty sure everyone's experienced bad connection so that and when the reason to get back to panic knifing is he saw like when when I popped up you saw that he knifed me once and he missed right and he knifed me again so it's a panic knife what can you do not really that much you can do but whatever I heard that what they're doing for the next Call of Duty is that they're putting in a, a knife will be uh, two two hit kills which I wouldn't mind that be a good idea what what I would think is that if a knife from the back like if I stabbed you in the back uh, one you would have a cool animation right like battlefield when you go up behind someone you grab their head and then you like cut their throat and whatnot that'd be cool and it would be a one hit kill to the back. But then some people were saying that, oh, there's going to be a perk where, like, um, 
you can have a one hit in insta kill knife, right? Like how it's been in the past Call of Duties, right? But you have to like use a perk for that, right? But I'm not sure how that's gonna play out because the perk might be in the same tier as sleight of hand or who knows for Black Ops 2 because uh they say that they're gonna be changing the whole create a class kill streak system and they say that they're like essentially making a COD from scratch because I'm pretty sure by now most of you have seen the trailer it's like the 14th and the thing came out on the first so most of you have seen it and it's in the future so I'll probably talk about that in a later video but uh, update quick on my channel about the bloodless montage it might be coming out this week I don't know I will try and convert it just give me a cup just give me time that's all I have